What's up everybody? A lot of people have been requesting that I show them how to install my texture pack, which is Misa's 64 by 64 realistic texture pack. It's basically like an HD texture pack. Makes Minecraft look really good. So let me go ahead and show you it real fast. So here's a loading screen. And then you can see right off the bat that it changes all of this and it gives you a nice fancy text or font but people have had problems um, with this font so I'll show you how to fix that too so here we are the grass looks nice everything just looks real the torches look really nice too my favorite part of the texture pack would be the glass because you can actually see through it now um, here's water. And the water is animated. Here's what the wood looks like. Here's the sugar cane. I think that's what it's called, or the bamboo. Here's some wood doors. Um, I'm holding a bucket in my hand. The fire looks nice too. Got a furnace right here. Um, here's a crafting bench and a chest. And if you're using too many items, um, all the textures will be in here too. So you can see all the textures. Here's just what everything looks like. Here's a sword. This is what the portal looks like. Just a really nice, realistic looking texture pack. So that's it for the texture pack. I didn't really mean to close out of that, but I guess I'm done showing you it now. So you're going to need MC Patcher and Misa. So let me go ahead and show you how to get those. So you're going to come here. Uh, this is the link for the texture pack. You're going to scroll down. You can try using the Dropbox, but it hasn't been working for me. Yeah, it's still not working for me. So you should probably just do Mediafire. And if anybody doesn't know how to use Mediafire, just go ahead and click on click here to start download. I'm sure you could figure it out on your own, but I'll show you it anyways. So it brings down this box, save it to your desktop. I already have it, so I'm not going to save it. And then you're going to come here for the MC patcher. And you're going to scroll down to where you see latest download. And if you're on Windows, you're going to download Windows. If you're on Mac, download the Mac one, and everybody else, like if you're on uh, Linux or something like that, just download this one. So then we're going to go ahead and I'm on Windows, so I'd click on Windows. Then I'd save it to my desktop, but I already have it, so I'm not going to. So that's how to get everything. And if you notice, I have this thing here called default. Um, this is the default text of Minecraft, just a normal uh, pixel looking text you're gonna wanna save this to your desktop or somewhere just in case your text gets messed up so let me go ahead and show you how to get this so we're gonna go ahead and hit start if you're on Windows 7 you could just type in percent app data percent into here but if you're not on Windows 7 and you're on like XP or Vista just type in run and then open up run and then here's where you'll type in um, percent app data percent and then just hit OK. And that'll bring you to um, my, your roaming. You should open up dot Minecraft. You can open up your bin. And you're going to need um, Windows, or not Windows, you're going to need WinRAR for this. So just click on it, click on your Minecraft jar, then right click it and do open with WinRAR Archiver or Archiver. You don't need this open anymore. Just go ahead and go into font and take this uh, default.png and drag it to your desktop like I did and the reason you're gonna need to save that is because Mises uh, texture pack as I already showed you comes with a different um, font so um, and if you use if you mod your minecraft more than likely you're gonna run into a problem with that font so I'll show you what it looks like later on 
So here's the MC patcher. You can go ahead and click on texture pack, hit browse, and I have Misa saved on my desktop, so I'm going to click on it and then hit open. And then here's all your options. You have animated water, custom water, animated lava, custom lava, animated fire, custom portal, high res font. Um, you don't need any of this. So we're just going to go ahead and hit patch and hit OK. And it'll scroll down and it'll say success probably. And then that's how you install it. So let me go ahead and install mod loader so you can see what mod loader does to the text. So I'm going to install it and I will be right back. All right, so I installed mod loader and like I said, if you mod Minecraft, you're going to have you're probably going to have to do this anyways because almost every mod uses mod loader. So when you open up Minecraft and go ahead and log in. This is what mod loader does to the text if you have the um, special font from the texture pack installed so it makes it all jumbled up and you can hardly read anything it just looks all bad and everything so let me go ahead and show you how to fix this you should have saved your default minecraft text to your desktop like I showed you earlier if you um, didn't do it when I showed you it you can just go ahead and uh, force update your Minecraft or delete your bin from your Minecraft jar and it'll restore back to no texture pack and you could save the default text then so what you're gonna do is you're gonna open up Visa you're gonna scroll down to font and you're gonna take this default uh, Minecraft font and drag it in and then just hit OK and that'll change the font to the original Minecraft font so you're going to go ahead and repatch it with now that you change the font and it should fix it like I said you're only going to need to do this if you mod your minecraft and you use mod loader so there you go you're back to the normal minecraft font which isn't bad um, it's actually I prefer this than the uh, different font that the texture pack gives you so that's how you fix it I still have mod loader installed the text is fine so that's it for anybody that was wondering how to fix it or install the texture pack um, so yeah that's pretty much it thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time